everybody and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. Now that it is 2019, I figured I would go through all of my Bath & Body Works wallflower bulbs that I used up in 2018. I don't know as if I've ever seen someone else do this. If they have, I'm not trying to steal the idea from them. I just know that I have been collecting all my empty wallflower bulbs for the year and figured it would be something fun for you guys to see so you guys can see some of the scents that I've used and liked. If you guys would like to see another one of these in a year, for the 2019 bulbs that I've used up. Be sure to let me know in the comments down below. And without further ado, let's get started. So for those of you who do not know what wallflower bulbs are, they are basically the scents and they are literally little bulbs, looks like a Christmas tree light bulb, filled with a scent and you can buy them at Bath & Body Works. I have one of these plugged in throughout the entire year and obviously when they get empty, I change the scent and I average about one a month and I don't switch them out based on the season. I just use the ones I really like. A lot of the ones in here are fall scents that I had from last year that I started using at the beginning of 2018 and I will be going through and putting them into groups based on categories such as summer scents and fall scents and winter scents and in total right now I have 11 because the one I put in for December is still going it only has a little bit left that bulb is just fresh balsam which as we know is my absolute favorite scent of all time so now I'm gonna go through organize them and then I will be back to show you guys the ones I've used up Starting off, I have two of the aromatherapy ones with the essential oils. The first one is just the eucalyptus one, and then I also have the lavender one. I absolutely love the essential oil ones. They are just really soothing and nice, and I absolutely love the way this lavender one smells. It's very soothing, and it's a perfect one to put in if you are under a lot of stress. And the eucalyptus one smells exactly like all the other eucalyptus stress relief products at Bath & Body works. And then for spring slash summer, I have four. I have golden jasmine, which I really wasn't a fan of this one. However, when I put these in, I don't take them out. If I don't like it, I still let them go. This one to me is just really pungent and not something I would get again. I have French lavender and this is actually my second one. I had to return the first one because the entire stem turned green and the entire thing smelled like mold and they compared it to this one and it was in fact discolored and was moldy. So I just switched it out for the same one. In comparison to this lavender one, this one is definitely different. I think the scent for this one is a lot more subtle and if I had to choose, I would definitely go with the essential oil one. And then I have limoncello. This is a very different scent. It is lemony, but it's like a very sweet lemon. It does smell very nice and refreshing and it is perfect for summer. And this is one of those bulbs that would be perfect to use in your kitchen. And then lastly, for spring and summer scents, I have Blue Ocean Waves. I absolutely loved this scent and I actually went back and got more of them that I can use in 2019 because I enjoyed it so much. It is definitely a true summer scent. It smells like the beach and summer in general, but it isn't an overpowering scent. And then I just have six different fall scents. The two right here are the older packaging, which is why they look like this and are actual bulbs. The newer ones are flat on the bottom so you can stand them up like this. These ones you cannot do that with. But I have Apple Orchard, which is a well-known fall scent for Bath & Body Works, as well as Spiced Pumpkin Cider. The Spiced Pumpkin Cider smells like a bakery during the fall time and smells so good. And then the Green Apple Orchard just smells like green apples. A another apple scent that I use, I actually used two of them, are the Heirloom Apple. This one smells exactly like peeled Macintosh apples, like if you were prepping them to make a apple pie. That's exactly what the heirloom apples bulb smells like and I absolutely love it. It is so nice. I used up a pumpkin pecan waffles which is another Bath & Body Works scent that is well known during the fall time and this one is very pastry like sweet but it also has a kick to it. I can't tell what the kick to it is. It's probably the pumpkin but all I can tell you is it smells delicious and it's one of the ones that you want to eat but obviously can't. And lastly for the bulbs that I have used up for 2018 is leaves. This is another classic that a lot of people get from Bath & Body Works for a candle. I don't even know how to describe the scent because leaves really don't have a smell, but basically when you think of fall and you think of being cozy with a nice scarf 
scarf on outside taking a walk in the woods. That's kind of how it smells like. So those are all of the wallflower bulbs I used up during 2018. If you guys like this video and think I should do it again next year, be sure to let me know in the comments down below. While you guys are down there, be sure to hit that subscribe button. I upload two to three new videos a week and would love it if you'd become part of the Alley Packer Squad. I hope you guys like this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys! Bye.